Hello everyone and thanks for joining me on this flight to Amersfoort in Virginia. With Woodstock Tower in the back, I'm gliding at 5,000 feet to the Page Valley. I'm taking a straight line to this spot. It's a valley protected by the winds and a good thermal source. The mountain in the back is called Matthew's Arm and is part of the Shenandoah National Park. The next step is catching the thermal in Brown Town. That one is typically in this area. Flying over Skyland Drive, you see Brown Town below with Hogback to the left and Woodstock on the horizon. Continuing over the Shenandoah National Park, you have options to catch the Lee Side Thermal. I like the thermal at Wolf Mountain, but this time I'm taking the thermal at this point, called the peak. And that thermal pushes me through the inversion towards 7000 feet. This puts me on a line to Warrington, Virginia. Notice down below the power line and the Rappahannock River, both good thermal sources. With a couple of more thermals, I arrive at the east of Amersville. Here I encounter east winds and decide to make a U-turn to the mountains to fly downwind again. Down below is Spillman Park Disc Golf Course, one of my favorite courses to play. The course offers a mix of open and wooded shots. The sun is getting lower and I decide to follow Route 211 to the east where I will hit 522 next to the mountains. I'm getting under the inversion and continue quite low till I hit the deck west of Amersville, close to Little Washington. The red line is my flight track going over the Shenandoah National Park with the U-turn between Warrington and Culpeper. Thanks for watching this Stompsy paragliding video.